sit down video. This is crazy. I love you. Love you too. I think I'm gonna sit on my legs. So I'm gonna get a little more extra. Want high. some books a little bit? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I need a booster seat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and we're using napkins today. So, mm. so we ain't gotta use my shirt? We don't gotta use your shirt today. Mm. <laughs> White for me, so white for you, for both, and the plate. All right, guys, this is crazy. We're doing a sit-down video. Mukbang, can you guys see what everything what we got? We literally have all different types of crabs here. What kind of crabs do we have? We got blue crabs, Dungeness crabs, and king crabs. Yay, I'm so excited. And we have some sausage right here. And in here we have scallop, scallops, um, shrimp, yeah. and eggs. And right here we have some potatoes. And we have my boyfriend's special sauce that he made. And right here we have some hot sauce because, you know, like things maybe a little spicy. But anyways, um, yeah, we're about to do this eating video because we spent like at least four hours making this whole entire meal yeah and we're actually ready to chow down so i think we should just make our plates now mm -hmm. i'm gonna start with some potatoes mm -hmm. literally like hurt you I don't even want to know the damage that you can get from trying to catch these no I want to find out <laughs> <laughs> I want to catch them so bad mm -mm -mm. The sauce. So I'm gonna just dip the sauce you mind mm, go ahead <laughs> Mm -hmm. How is it? It's so delicious. I just really can't even believe we committed to talking. Yeah? Yeah. Sorry. I believe you've actually let me try this sauce. <laughs> so we're literally like crab fiends. We go crabbing. Um. We go crabbing, we usually catch, well, we only catch blue crabs around here in Florida. But we're pretty much crab fiends. Like we'll go catch some and we'll buy, buy more stuff. <laughs> so that's pretty much what we did today. We went on a bit of a journey and got some blue crabs. We got all this food for us to eat today. Which I'm super excited about. As always, because I'm fat. Oh man, I've been craving crabs for so long. You have? Yes. I've been talking about it for weeks. I know. I thought he was gonna like have crabs without me. Can't believe you let me go so long without him. <laughs> Never again. These king crabs are so delicious. Mmm. You want some hot sauce in there? Mm-hmm. Okay. So the topic for today, which really isn't a topic, it's just more of a discussion. This is the first time that we've actually done a video together, so... <laughs> I'm excited for you guys to hear us talk about what it was like for us meeting and basically what it was like for our relationship, just like a regular relationship um, and my boyfriend meeting someone who was like 
in the porn industry, you know, webcam, that kind of stuff. So first and foremost, I want to ask, how do we meet? Let's let everyone know how we met. Um, say Facebook. Okay, can we get like a little like story? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we need to. Well, how do you meet on Facebook? Like in some of her pictures, and she says something about one day she don't feel pretty or something. So I wrote on her page that, you know, she looks gorgeous and this and that. Then a week later, I found out she goes to the same club that I go to. We just end up going different times. So I made it my business to go at the same time she goes. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. I love this story. So I ended up going to the same time she goes. And at this time, we did have a mutual, mutual acquaintances that I ended up asking about. That ended up telling her that she had a crush. And then after that, it just took off after that as a little friendly conversation on Facebook. And then I ended up catching a lizard one time. And she ended up commenting that she wanted one. And then we got to talking about food, of course. <laughs> and then she ended up talking about this crab place she likes. And I told her I was going to take her. And I did keep my promise, I did take her. <laughs> he did take me. You yeah. know? Lots of times. So after that we started just talking and then we finally exchanged numbers and then he couldn't get us off the phone after that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> such a sweet romance. Yes. It literally is such a sweet romance. So like how did you find out that something was up with me? Just like something was, you know, what I mean by something is up with me, like, you know, I'm not like, you know, every other girl. When I come home to my house, I have lights, camera, action, and, you know, I work online, I do my thing online, you know, get naked, whatever. I have my fans online. So I'm saying that's like a very extra part of my life. So when did you first know that something was just up with this girl? I said the first time she invited me to her house. <laughs> I went in the room and I was laying there and then I was just look around. You know, of course you're going to look around. I noticed a strange He's looking so chair. Funny, you guys. I noticed that strange looking chair, which ended up being like that sex chair. Then I know this lights up on the top, but I never asked her about it. I just kept it to myself. I just knew, you know, this wasn't just no normal person that you walked into every day. <laughs> That's funny. So after that, we just, everything just fell in place pretty much. She ended up telling me how everything occurred on her own. Never really asked, I just, really just noticed different stuff. So I, I told you on my own. Mm -hmm. You never, yeah, I don't remember him asking anything. I definitely like to come clean so that would be true, I do. I like to, especially if I like somebody you know, I'm gonna let them know kind of what I'm up to, just by nature. Hmm, that's funny. Yeah. So the sex chair gave it away. Yeah, and the lights on the roof. And yeah. the lights, I kind of have like a disco ball going around my room like, who yeah. has this kind of stuff? Who? I do. She always thought it was a stripper pole, but to me the stripper pole was kind of common in the 2000s. Like it wasn't something that i never been with nobody that had a stripper pole in their room, but you know, you noticed it on social media a lot. What so you don't notice normal. was the sex chairs and the, the lights. <laughs> 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 so that was something different.
so like in the beginning like did you did you think like oh this is something that i don't want to handle or i don't know if i can handle this no i actually wanted a change in my life i was looking for something to spice it up a little bit i'm the right spice yeah yeah that's cute yeah yeah so yeah i guess after meeting you you know i definitely noticed that things were a lot spicy with us so things just seem spicy the one thing that i really enjoy about our relationship is the fact that we can be like open inside of the world of of like the naughty world like i feel like we're very open and stuff so and like i forget things just because i don't really know why i suffer from short-term memory loss but that's why i have my boyfriend here because he's gonna he's gonna make sure that he remembers things i forget nothing and it's awesome because he forgets nothing. <laughs> so, so how did it turn out that we started like filming, like doing videos or even talking about webcamming stuff or mm -hmm. just any of that kind of stuff together? Well, how did it turn out that we started doing like stuff like this together? And just basically just fell in place when when we started basically having sex in the car, she asked me to film it one time. So I filmed it. And then after that, it kind of just took off. And then it took off from there to my house and then playing drunk on O. <laughs> until everything else just came into play with that. We definitely played Drunk Uno around 12 or 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah. Drunk as hell. Playing Uno. Wait. We had his door We had his door open. I remember that part. And she ran outside naked. <laughs> and then ran back in. And then sat on the couch and then was talking to me and knocked the camera over because she was scared someone would walk up by. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, we've had a lot of fun times. 